body is under attack, some diseases kill the red blood cells. Excuse me, ma'am, what seems to be the problem here? Well, the thing is, the body's been experiencing all these symptoms, like diarrhea, and sometimes pale skin, sometimes jaundice, and dark brown urine, and muscle pains, and rapid heartbeat, and vomiting, and nausea. Hmm. Well, the symptoms you have described are very uncommon. I'm not sure what it is. But it seems there is a form of anemia that has been attacking the body. This only occurred, this form that you have described though, I've only heard of in 5% of all cases. Now it could be a result of sickle cell disease, which affects African Americans and Aborigines and Arabs. But I do not know what the exact cause of this anemia is and who the killer is. But I will find out for you. Call detective, find it out for me. No fear, miss. I shall. Hmm, well, who could it be? Couldn't it be the osteoblast? They have nothing to do with blood. No. Hmm, could it be the osteocytes? No, I don't think we'll be that. Would be them. Ah, the platelets. There is my suspect. <laughs> oh, hey, where are you going? Ah, uh, hey. I'm just going to the lungs because I'm deoxygenated right now and like I need more oxygen. Oh, me too. Did you hear about the blood cell massacre? That's really scary. Yeah, but whatever. It's not that scary. Actually, massacre. Wait, I can like die. Yeah, it's really serious. So, who do you think did it? I don't know. How am I supposed to know that? Well, let's see. The blood cells that destroy the spleen and liver, right? Who destroys them? I don't know. Don't expect me to know everything. It's the macrophages, right? But that's our detective, so I guess not. Well, maybe the detective is... What's it called? Ah... Uh... <gasps> no! It can't be! Hello, I have found for you the suspect. The platelet. You are the suspect. Yes. Well, we've been examining evidence and it seems that you are the murderer. No! No! You blew my cover! Uh, I admit to it. Yes, I just blamed the platelets just because I wanted someone to blame. I did it. But the antibodies made me. Certain antibodies signaled for me to kill our own body's red blood cells. Once the cell reached the spleen where I was waiting, I saw the sign. And, following orders, I began to pull away at the cell's membrane, which caused it to die. Afterwards, ashamed of what I had done, I ran away. So, that's my story. But, the um, antibody that labeled that specific red blood cell was a warm antibody, which functions at 37 degrees Celsius and above, but there are also cold antibodies that may be in this organism that we are all living in, and they attack at lower temperatures. But the thing is, we don't know what caused these antibodies to attack these red blood cells. The only thing we know is they're associated with underlying conditions, such as other autoimmune diseases, and hepatitis, and HIV, and lymphatic diseases, also certain drugs. So the only way we could prevent it is by preventing those diseases, and the only way we could treat it is by treating those diseases, or perhaps by removing the spleen where the red blood cells are destroyed. So the only thing we can do is to give you immune suppressive drugs. 
I'm gonna take you to jail. No. Is it recording? Quality. There's been a problem. <laughs> Dark brown <laughs> muscle pains and um what is what is the other thing? I can't go back. It's not going back!